When you hear the term space weather, it doesn't mean trying to predict a chance of having meteor showers in the forecast. But certain types of events in space can impact us here on Earth. Meteorologist Kralis Ortiz explains what science says about space weather. Space weather. It's defined as the variations in space environment between the sun and Earth and how it impacts systems and technologies in orbit and on Earth. The sun plays a huge role in influencing space weather. During a powerful solar storm, the sun produces coronal mass ejections, or CMEs, which are made up of magnetized solar particles called plasma. This is the same phenomena that creates the spectacular northern lights. And during these events, 100 million tons of plasma is ejected from the sun's surface, traveling over a million miles per hour. This creates geomagnetic storms here on Earth, but thanks to the Earth's magnetic field, we are protected. Space weather events like these could disrupt our power grids, impact GPS coordinates, and create other magnetic changes that impact different technology is strong enough. Solar flares are different from CMEs. Each travel at different speeds and have different impacts on Earth. CMEs look more like a large wave of gas versus flares looking like a bright light. Flares can produce strong X-rays and disrupt the area where high-frequency radio waves travel in the atmosphere and block them. This can lead to temporary blackouts in navigation and in communication events known as radio blackout storms. And just like meteorologists can use various weather models to help create a forecast, scientists at the Space Weather Prediction Center can use simulations to help predict these mass ejection arrivals, helping alert certain groups ahead of time that may be impacted by these events, such as power companies or airlines. With THB 11, I'm Corrales Ortiz. Space weather. I got to admit, Scott, this is the first time I've really learned anything right. about space weather before. Had never really thought about it. So it's kind of interesting to hear how it can have an effect on us. But it's very, very rare if, if it's really ever happened at all. It's very, very rare. And it's one of those things that even though it may have an effect on us, it's very rarely sensible here mm. on the surface. Uh, it's not going to affect things that you and I might experience on a day to day basis here at Earth. But other folks that are dealing with science and uh, high tech operations, they may, of course, be very in tune to such as airlines and folks like that. Can we just like blame space weather whenever we have other I do problematic all the time. weather? I do literally all the <laughs> it's time. It's snowing. Oh, space, space weather, weather again. <laughs> Man, my call dropped space oh. weather. Weather. Yep, everything Man. is now space weather. Telemarkers, weather's problem. space weather. <laughs> right, robocalls. My taxes are due, space weather. <laughs> I like this. We've got something going.